Hi, this is Archana. Today I will take you all to online trading on Zerodha. How to trade online directly? You can come to tra Zerodha website. Directly you can come to trading login, or else you directly you can type in URL trade.zerodha.com. Give your ID and sign in. When you will sign in, first time it will ask you for the security emails. You can provide your password here. After that you can log in in the system. Then it will ask you two security questions which will, which will always ask you whenever you will log into any trading terminal of Zerodha. So when will it come here? You need to come to the trade for doing the trade. Come to the option Z5 which we are going to explain you today. This is a, a web version where you can do the trade easily. So here you can see uh, whenever you want to create a market watch first of all you just need to come to the create a market watch when you create it will come give some name so you can give some name of your market watch you can create it it will create your exchange will show and a 4 CDS and a CBSC whatever it will show you can just add it then you can add your commodity segment suppose we are going to buy something so we will add it it will ask for the expiry Add to the market watch when you do add to the market watch your script will successfully add in market watch you can see it your ABC market watch is showing one script here so if you want to go for buy it you just click on the buy button or new pop-up screen will open that will show for the buy how to buy so here you can see all the details of crude oil market is going on you can see the fluctuation in the market this is your buy window by default it will show always buy and exchange will show MCX order types by default always it will show limit if you want to go for the buying on your own price you can put your order here at what price you want to buy if you want to buy at 3000 not some market price you do not want to buy you want to buy at some lesser price you can give it here suppose you want to go on this price in the limit you can select limit you can provide your price here you can give this is the validity day that by default always it will be here product code you can select normal MIS or cover order there are three kind of product code you can see in the product code type so there is a normal if you want to carry forward till the expiry date MIS order in the sense you want to buy today and selling today only that is MIS order margin intraday square of this is cover order for you three kind of product code we are providing to you you can use any of them in order type if you want to go for market price then you can select market then you cannot provide your price here it cannot be select at all uh, what is whatever will be the market price at that price itself your order will be placed so you can select market next order you can see here it is showing SLL what is the meaning of SLL it is means stop loss limit or this next is the stop loss market so you can select any of them also SLL if you give the SLL you can you have to give one trigger price also for stop loss for stopping the stop loss that is a kind of limit order where you are giving the stop loss SLM is the kind of market order where you are providing a trigger price for stopping your loss so both are the kind of uh, stop loss orders and uh, whenever you want to place uh, whenever you will submit the orders when you do the submit button click your transaction password will be asked to you okay so you can click there and give the transaction password and suppose if you are giving an aftermarket order it is a AMO aftermarket order you can select here market is not on you can give your order for the uh, after 6 30 when market is off 6 30 to morning 9 o'clock you can place your order for the equity segment and after 12 o'clock you can place your order, order for the M6 segment so you can here you can see the details of crude oil what is going on what is highest price what is average price all what who all are the best five bidders who are buying who are selling those you can see here so if you want to go for selling you can click selling the same pop-up screen will open the color will be only change so here everything will be the same limit market your order type will be the same at what price you want to sell it you can select that here one thing you always keep in mind whatever product code you have selected while buying the product and the same product code you have to select while selling it so if you bought in MIS you have to sell in MIS only if you bought in cover order normal you have to sell in normal so this is the one thing which you have to keep in always in mind okay so here we can see the limit option you want to you will click on the limit your balance will show here whatever amount is there in your account holdings you can see in this positions and next here is your order book your trade book your position book whatever order you will be placing it will show in your order book 